Okay, we should hopefully be back. And yeah, I'm not quite sure exactly what was going on there, but uh, something was up with the <laughs> the capture card. But you know, the the, the tried and true uh, try turning it on and off again fixed it just fine. <laughs> So we're, we're, we're back in business. Alrighty. Let's uh, make my way over to this next gym. Wait. There's another person to beat up. So strong. So rare. So you're a bull. I mean, I am a dark type Pokemon user, so... Kind of? <laughs> we are alive now! Hell yeah. You want to see my strong and rare Pokemon, don't you? Don't you? Yes, I do. What do you got? Mikel, the Pokemon maniac. I love their weird little hairdos. Oh, he's got that thing! That thing's awesome! It's cool looking. Yeah, it really is cool looking. Light screen! Oh, you suck. <laughs> it burned me. Don't like that action. Not one. Ow. Yeah, the orange light. I'll, I'll try to get up there and take a look and see which one it is. All right, so if you're a fire boy. Ooh, I could send you out, but you're not going to listen to me. Yeah, let's send in, uh, send in my boy Houndoom here to take care of this little situation for me. Burn this. Whoops. Well, that was not the right button. Oh, you don't have your psychic typing yet. You're just a fire type. Okay. Interesting. I'm very peculiar. Ow. Rude. He avoided it? No way. Shenanigans. <laughs> the focus sash endeavor. Yeah, I don't have that up. <laughs> that would be, uh, that's a pretty good tactic for farming experience, though, now that you mention it. That would be kind of funny. <laughs> to start wrecking stuff. Oh, he's about to send out a spirit tomb. I don't have anybody with a fairy attack. Switch Pokemon. Who would be good for dealing with the spirit tomb? Ponyard could probably give it a good run for his money. If he had a fairy type attack, he'd be awesome. Hmm. Yeah, because those two won't listen to me. Sure, let's give Ponyard to go. Level 1 Rattaton Sword. How many levels did you get? <laughs> that must have, like, skyrocketed to, like, level 30 at least in one go, right? Oh, thanks, Dream Elements. I appreciate it. Okay. Assurance isn't going to do a whole lot. Torment could be fun with this boy, though. Let's torment him. Heh, <laughs> spite. What a waste. Cut him down. It's gonna take a minute. Oh, crap, it knows nasty plot. I don't know if I like that. Uh, that's vaguely concerning. And I missed. Shit. This is a problem. And my light screen wore off. Uh-oh. Ponyard, you need to start hitting a little harder. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ooh. Thankfully, it's not very effective. And you can't use it twice in a row. <laughs> All 
right, little buddy. Don't miss on your next attack. Please don't miss. Yes. Good job, little guy. I believed in you and it paid off. <laughs> yeah, look at his little victory pose. <laughs> what a little psycho. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> the thrill of battle. It gives me all that I need. All right, how does one get up there to go see what that is? Aha, around here. Perfect. Let's go check what this little glowy boy is. That's a whole ass Garchomp. Nope, not not touching that. That thing's gonna be, I think Pinata went and poked that boy. That thing was like level 65, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, you know, oops. Yeah. Just, just a little on the scary side. Definitely would wipe my team. Hyper Potion. What's in here? A flying grammar. Oh god! Mm. Somebody shat out the airplane. That sounds um. That sounds unpleasant. That is the last thing that we need in this world is flying grimers. <laughs> yeah, that's... I have to I have to do the world a favor here and dispose of this creature before it spreads. <laughs> it's not okay. Wait, why are you that? You shouldn't be that. My little uh overlay here got messed up. There we go. There's my little poniard boy. Just realized for some reason it turned the bishop on. Bishop on. He hasn't evolved yet. Thing you know. Yeah. Words. Stone Edge! Boo! <laughs> God damn! Freaking Pupitar, man. I can't wait till you evolve, my boy. And it's already down. <laughs> He's got balloons! <laughs> Sure, I'll, I'll catch a flying Grimer. Why not? Maybe I can trade it to the uh, to the to the flying type user and get something in return. <laughs> you want you want a, you want a flying pile of toxic sludge? It's a good deal. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Experience candy medium. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. Give me some some large experience candies, please. I would like those very much. Shing Grimer. Born from sludge, these Pokemon now gather in polluted places and increase the bacteria in their bodies. Disgusting. Get in the box, Grimer. Get in the bag, Nebby. God damn it. <laughs> My brain was itching like, there's something that sounds like that. And yes. Did it. You did the thing. You did the fucking thing. Uh-huh. Hey, those memes were great. You know what? I think I should have a picnic. It's picnic time, everybody. Who wants a sandwich? Everybody out of the balls! Woo! I'm just shoving and there's this back in the ball for uh, no good reason. Freeloading dragon motorcycle that doesn't fight for me. Let's wash my cat. Yippee. Whoops, wrong button. I wanna wash the cat. There we go. Scrub a dub dub. Gotta clean that frigatito. <laughs> nice, all clean. And then we can wash the the pupitar, which just sounds very weird. <laughs> Not like he can do much to clean himself. There you go, buddy. Just scrub them all up, nice and sudsy. 
There you go. Nice. I feel like spraying him down might be painful. Yo, Sneasel. Do you wanna do you wanna be like better friends than we are? Cause usually when you do these things in the previous games, it like uh increases how much they like you, and I'm hoping maybe he'll listen to me more <laughs> if I'm nice to him. At least you would be immune to toxic spikes. It's a good point. Let's scrub all the blood off of my pond here. <laughs> <laughs> it's been on a bit of a spree here. Got to clean all that <laughs> before he rusts. <laughs> Who's a good little murder machine? Yes, you are. All right, sandwich time. Making sandwiches. What kind of sandwiches can I make? I only have these recipes. I have, like, way more ingredients, though. Do creative mode. Let's just make my own sandwich. Oh, dude, prosciutto? Hell yeah. Cheese. Um... We don't really have a lot of vegetables to go in here, do we? Pickle sounds like a bit much. Um... Yeah, we'll say, yeah, prosciutto, cheese, mayonnaise, and butter. Why not? And yeah, we'll put a pick in there. Ah, oh, yeah, that looks good. Get that prosciutto on there. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's going to be good. Hell yeah. Oh, and the cheese. I am terrible at making sandwiches in this game. It's so, like, could you like give me a shadow so I could see where the thing's gonna drop? That'd be really cool. Hell yeah, nailed it. Perfect sandwich. Watch it be like some horrible combination. The game's like, ew, gross, why would you do that? <laughs> I've bathed in the blood of thine enemies, master. <laughs> <You're> right. <laughs> Straight up. Now have a sandwich. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Did I do good? Did I make a good sandwich? Is the game going to reward me? Yeah. Good sandwich. I succeeded. A tasty lunacy original. Oh, dude, three star sandwich. Hell yeah. Raid power, experience points, and encounter power, flying. Neat. All right, there you go. You've all had a sandwich. You've been bathed. Nothing in the basket. Let's get out of here. Free experience. Onward to victory. We got another gym to take out. We're going after the normal type gym next, I think. Flamingos! Oh my god, look at them. They're so derpy. What <laughs> one? <laughs> They're so cute. They are indistinguishable from <laughs> flamingos with an N. <laughs> yes. Those are just actual real ass flamingos oh god they're aggressive sneasel save me sneasel why aren't you protecting me sneasel you jerk fight i thought you're supposed to be a predator you're supposed to hunt things rude i see how it is he doesn't want to listen to me he's like i ain't fighting for your ass be that way, Sneasel. Fine. Oops. Wrong button. We'll send the Houndoom out here. He'll go, he'll go surely wreck some stuff for me. 
Or actually, oh wait, yeah, we should fight this person first. Behold my illusions. Flamingo is dangerous as fuck though, you're not wrong. He's gonna be nasty if somebody uses it against uh, uh, the ghost trainer, because that flamingo can hit ghosts with fighting moves and that's not nice. Ooh, a drift limb. Nice. I do like drift limbs. Light screen. Shing. What you got, drift limb? Oh, you're gonna taunt me? I was gonna taunt you. Beat me to it. Sucker punch. Blammo. Not very effective though. Oh, you're a Zora. Oh, you sneaky little shit. I'm listening. <laughs> get rid of my light clay. Oh, you punk ass. <laughs> oh, you're going to get it. Get in here, Ponyard. Sneaky fox. <laughs> it is freaking adorable. Look at that thing. You want to be one. Right. Alright, little buddy. Torment him. Ah, damn it, he hit me with the taunt first. That's right, he's faster. And failed. Alright, fine. Have it your way. Get Metal Clawed. Ow. Miss! Damn it! Get more accurate. Ooh, special defense. Harshly fell. Oh, that's right, but he's got Defiant. <laughs> yes, make him stronger. Go forth, my little poniard. Slay. Ah, there's the actual Drift Blim. Um, yeah, we'll keep we'll keep him out. He's actually looking pretty pretty healthy right now. He's got a stage of attack boost. And uh Yeah, we can hit this boy with some assurance. Oh, he's stockpiling though. These Drift Blims have so much health. Or not. Apparently not enough <laughs> to survive an attack boosted Bonyard, though. <laughs> Never mind, I spoke too soon. Damn, that thing gave me a lot of XP, though. Actually, I didn't see right through your illusions, technically. That was, uh, that definitely caught me by surprise. You know what to do, Houndoom. That's right. Give me that banana tree monster. All of the bananas. Apples and bananas. Ow. An electric seed. The train becomes electric train. The holder gets some type of a bonus. I didn't catch what that was. Sneasel, come on, man. Work with me. There's a whole herd of crows here you could beat up. But you don't want to do it. You punk-ass bitch. One day I'll get you to listen to me. One day. Look at this fucking fake-ass tree, motherfucker. Ow. Why did that an Amoongus kicked my ass? Oh, because of tight matchup. Where the fuck is the Sudowoodoo going? He's just falling ass, dude. He's out of here. <laughs> it's bye. Um Yeah, let's heal up my uh Hound Doom here. There's a bunch of things over here there for him to fight. 
Oh, there's a jump luff. Hell yeah. Get them all. Destroy. Slay. Good job, Houndoom. Get the big one. Get the big one. Don't let him escape. Yes. <laughs> Woo, 649. That's what I'm talking about. Tropius. Nice. Now we're making some good progress. Shroomish. I think I should be able to handle the next gym now. Shouldn't be too hard. I want to go take a look around here a little bit more, though. See what's up here. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Houndoom is just tearing this place apart. He ain't playing. Hey, dude. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, dog boy. Good dog. Just don't poke that pseudo voodoo. It's bad for your health. All of the banana dinosaurs, though, please. <laughs> right, the fucking pseudo voodoo just all booked it. It was not having any of it. He's like, I gotta get the heck out of here. <laughs> And he goes down. Ooh, give me ghoul. Just a whole ass koala bear right there. We got a trainer over here I can go mess with. Don't mind if I do. Um, you need to not be in position one, though. You're hurting for certain. My guys are a little beat up. Dude, there's a Hypno over there. Awesome. Could you be what I'm here to clean up? No, janitor man. I am not. Thomas, the janitor. Oh, that's a big swallow. Oh, God. <laughs> that is... That is certainly a mouth. Light screen! God, I need reflect so bad on this guy. Don't be doing that amnesia shit. Taunt. Come at me, bro. Haha, -ha, you fell for the taunt. Oh, that's super effective, though. That's a bit of a problem. Uh oh. Um, who is not super affected by that? Ponyard should be fine. He's not going to do a, lot, a whole lot of damage, though, but oh well. He won't get hurt, hurt by the acid spray. Doesn't affect me. <laughs> Take that. Assurance. Nice. With the crit, too. Oh, it's the only attack he has. Oh, no, the poor Swalot. Ah, the taunt wore off. Boo. Yeah, sure, I'll give you an encore. You got it, buddy. You want some more of this? You can have all the assurance you need. <laughs> Damn, little dude. Little Ponyard's kicking butt. You wiped the floor with me. You're damn right. All right. 
Yoink. To the town! Because I need to find a Pokemon Center. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? An Aguave Berry. Because if I keep leveling up my Pokemon, I'm <laughs> none of them are going to fucking listen to me here pretty soon. I got to be careful. I think I uh, need to really, really start getting these gym battles under control here. I'm in a bit of danger zone. Could botch my whole run. There we go. Get that team all nice and healed up. Perfect. Thank you kindly. Okay, let's see here. I've got some experience candy stuff that I can use, so I should probably use some of that. Because they'll listen to me up to level 35. So I can get these two up in levels a little bit more and make them a tad bit more useful. I just gotta make sure not to overshoot it. <laughs> How much does one medium candy do? 3,000? Okay. Oh, is he evolving? Ayo! Let's go, little imp dude! Hell yes! Nice! Morgrim! Very cool. Oh, we gotta, we gotta update my little, uh, my little list here. Okay, so... Where'd he go? The imp goes bye-bye. And there we go. And we put the Morgrim in. Nice. Shing. False surrender. I don't recognize that move. What are you? Power 80. The user pretends to bow its head, but then it stabs the target with a di with its disheveled hair. This attack never misses. Is that better than Sucker Punch, though? Sounds better. Yeah, but Sucker Punch is a priority move. Enables the user to attack first. This move fails if the target is not readying an attack, though, but Sucker Punch is really strong. That's pretty I'm, good, I'm though. Saying, attacks with hair. Yeah, I know. Sounds cool. It does sound pretty cool. Hi, Nikki. I know, you can't watch the spoilers. <laughs> oh, getting banned from Twitch for the night. All right. <laughs> Took your hearing aids. Have a nice lurk, Nikki. I appreciate it. I think I'm going to have to stick with the sucker punch. Just for the priority, because uh, this boy's not terribly fast. He needs the speed. All right, so let's give you like three of those. That's pretty good. All right, so that's like the perfect spot. And we'll give a large one to the Houndoom. He's level 35 now. Ooh, he can learn Torment. Just start stacking Torment to all my Pokemon. <laughs> That's mean. <laughs> okay. And then sure, let's give the last two medium candies to the to the Ponyard. Ding 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 ding! Level 35! Slash. No, I don't think you'll learn slash. Not today, sir. Okay. That's that's as high as my team can go for the next gym. I literally cannot level them up anymore, or none of them will listen to me.
Oh yeah, hearing aid technologies have gotten really cool. We were looking into that um, like a couple months ago. It's awesome. They can do all kinds of things I never used to be able to do before. Alrighty. Gym time. I haven't actually walked around in this town yet. Kind of want to take a look. Oh, dude, the Meowth Street Market. Hell yeah. <laughs> this is cool. Look at all that tasty food. Y'all just got restaurants in here? Is there any, like, cool clothing stores that I can check out? You want a nice hat? I do want a nice hat. The game has yet to provide me with one. Or a cool jacket. Or cool boots. It's a whole bunch of nothing. What is this store? Famed Treasure Eatery. Oh, no thanks. I'm not here looking for food. Ooh, a TM. Which one are you? Yoink. <gasps> Reflect! Ah, oh, shit, dude. Oh, my God. Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's happening. It's finally happening. Yes. Give it to him. <laughs> Sorry, fake out, but you gotta go. Taunt's a little more useful. <laughs> you have it and you can hear a gnat fart. <laughs> I believe it. <laughs> oh, dude, he's got reflect and light screen. Yeah, buddy. Now, that's what I'm talking about. All right, so this is the normal gym, huh? So, I'm assuming the normal gym is probably going to be using mostly physical attacks. And the little Ponyard boy should be able to weep through this pretty good, and I got some good backup, just in case it can't. And this should get me to where my Pokemon will finally start listening to me a bit. Oh, it's this dude. Well now, Lunacy. You appear to be progressing well on your gym circuit. What's this now? Is this that kid I've been hearing so much about? you are got a cool hairstyle. Hey, kiddo. I hear you're, like, way too good at battling, yeah? Yeah. I'd say so. <laughs> you got some spirit, big shot. This young lady would be Rika. Or Rika. I think Rika sounds better. That's me, Rika, here at your service. And hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get in intimidated or anything. She's a little farcical, shall we say. But like myself, she's a member of the Elite Four. I wasn't trying to be funny. Anyway, hmm. Tell you something, kiddo. You look fun, like, interesting, at a glance anyway. Naturally, he is one of the Academy's esteemed students. <laughs> Ooh, haha, <laughs> yeah, that checks out. Yes, that is a lady. But the battles you'll face at these gyms really ratchet up the further you go. Indeed, your average trainer abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. But not you, right, kiddo? See, when you hit the champion assessment, you show these gyms what you've got. Best of fortunes to you. Hell yeah, dog. Thanks, guys. Have a nice day. All right, what's the goofy challenge you got for me this time? So far, the olive rolling one has been my favorite. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Ludacy, yes? That is correct. Great. Now, in order to face gym leader Larry. <laughs> His name is Larry. Nice. <laughs> we our server where I read that uh, Totoro was almost English named to Craig. Craig? <laughs> Totoro was almost named Craig. That'd be funny as hell. No, in order to... Huh? The, the post also said that Miyazaki refused to change it because, and I quote, I wouldn't want to be named Craig. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Now, in order to face gym leader Larry... You'll first need to pass the gym test. 
Here at the Medali Gym, that means ordering a special secret menu item. Specifically, a menu at the Treasure Eatery, a much-loved restaurant here in Medali. Order correctly and you pass. Right now, there are three other challengers around town attempting this gym test. Each challenger has been given a different clue that'll help them discover the secret dish. You'll be given a clue as well. Please find and battle the other challengers. The loser must tell the winner their clue. Goal is to gather clues and use them to determine what the secret dish is, then order it from the waiter. That's kind of fun. All right. How the regulars season their dishes. Yes, you start by hearing what a regular at the Treasury Eatery has to say. All right, cool. So I have a little puzzle mystery to figure out here. Cool. Fake Surrender help you so much during Pokemon Sword. I could see that. It is a pretty good move. The, the bonus is with this game, you can just like remember moves whenever you want. I can just like go to the summary and then pop over here and just be like, remember moves. There it is. I can just teach it to him at any point if I want to swap out the attacks. So we're good on that. All right. Secret dish child number one. What's your clue? You can try to beat me to earn it. Ursa Ring. Ooh, that's a big bear. Look at that bear. Reflect. Shing. Now what you gonna do? Ooh, sweet scent. It's gonna lower my evasiveness. That could be vaguely concerning. Or I could just switch to Ponyard. <laughs> Are you going to try to do hit me with, like, guillotine or fissure or something? Ooh! Hit me with the fairy attack. Sneaky. That's okay. Assurance time, baby. Smack! Good thing I got that reflect up. Yes! Give me the defiance. I crave it. <laughs> Careful with that poniard. He gets awfully mean. Nice. Ooh, Dark Pulse. I want that on a different Pokemon, not you. You don't have very good special attack. <laughs> now, Houndoom. Houndoom needs some Dark Pulse. That's for sure. All right. Guess we should heal up the little Ponyard boy. Sure, have a Super Potion. Actually, you know what? I got tons of regular potions. I should use these. I got way too many regular potions. Got them coming out of my ears. You can just sell all those for money at this point. Not that it would give me very much, but... Ah, oh, dude! Another Leftovers! I don't really have another tanky Pokemon that could benefit from that. Maybe the Ponyard, actually. He's kind of tanky. <laughs> My Squawkabilly can talk! Quack, quack. Yes, I am taking the gym tests. Fight me. Get ready to spill the beans. Me and the boys out at 3 a.m. looking for beans. Santiago. Hell yeah, dude. That's a bad Oh, he's got a done sparse. <laughs> Look at that derpy little thing. Hyper drill, holy shit. Damn, son. Good thing I got that reflect up so fast. That could have been bad. Ah, you're not using an attack. What are you doing now? Oh, you suck. I should have went for taunt. All right, that's it. Pulling out the boy. 
Oh yeah, I gotta talk to them afterwards to get their clues. <laughs> I'm just like straight into battle mode. I'm like, I don't even care. <laughs> Fight me. <laughs> Not very effective, sir. Sorry. Alrighty. You know what? Yeah, let's hit you with assurance. Now you're gonna yawn. Of course. And then I'm gonna go to sleep. At the end of my next turn. I'm generally not that concerned, though. He <laughs> used yawn again. What a fool. What a darn fool. Yeah, he'll wake up eventually. It's not like this thing can really do any damage to me. Okay, that's super effective. He has a ground type move. Hey, little buddy, you want to wake up? Ow! Son of a bitch! Come on, little guy! Oh, jeez. He is really asleep. All that murder's got him tired, you know? Oh, and my reflect just wore off. That's a problem. Uh-oh. Backup plan. Get him, cat. <laughs> Alpha team failed. Go team beta. Or I guess team delta. I don't know. That was a crit? Jeez. All right, you need to go bye-bye. Oof. Damn, this little Dunsparce kicks ass. <laughs> yes, you do have to tell me your clue. Oh, HDMI switch bugged out there for a second. You good, computer? Okay, we're good. Yes, you do have to tell me your clue. Alright. The blue bird Pokemon. Which blue bird Pokemon? There's a couple. You talking like Golduck? You talking Rockabilly? We talking Ice Q? Any of the penguins? <laughs> What was your clue? A dark spot surrounded by stairs? Well, that's oddly specific. This thing. Some faint writing here. It says Fire Blast. Okay. So I figured out one of the clues. So, Bluebird Pokemon Fire Blast and how the locals season their food. Or the regulars season their food. <laughs> Dunsparce is done with everyone shitting on him. Yeah, no kidding. I love, I love how just, like, ridiculous his evolution is that they added in this game. They didn't even, like, give him, like, a new name or, like, really a new form. He just got a little bit bigger, and they called him Dun Dun Sparks. <laughs> He's extra Dun. <laughs> I fucking died when I saw that. <laughs> so funny. In incredibly stupid. Fucking Dun Dun Sparks. <laughs> the best shit ever. All right, where's this final child? Hello? Ooh, a full restore. That's a good find. You, you are the final child. <laughs> Excuse me, you're taking the gym test, right? Tell me your clue about the secret dish. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Only if you can beat me, kid. 
<laughs> yeah. Ah, I've got a gum shoes. What an interesting looking boy. Reflect time. Shing. Ha. <laughs> you missed. All right. I'm not even going to take chances with you. Get taunted. And then you're gonna get sucker punched. Oh, Super Fang! Ooh, good thing that's not very accurate anymore. Smack! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Yow! That's one way to get through Reflect. Ha! Ah, you missed again! You're probably just going to go for another hit, so... Yep. Get out of here. <laughs> Good job, Malfesto. Ooh, a Greedent. Um, sure. I'll switch my Pokemans for a Greedent. Let's send the fire dog out there. Why not? A ground surskit. <laughs> you find a, a one with a, a different Terra type. That's a big squirrel. He's a squirrely one. Let's do a little nasty plot flamethrower action here. Well, I still got that reflect up. <laughs> Body slam! Ow. Burn in the eternal fires. Good job, Houndoom. No, my cat leveled up to level 36. It's not going to listen to me anymore. I wish we could just trade clues like we trade Pokemon. You know what? You're right, kid. That does sound nice. <gasps> He's evolving! Despacito! Holy shit! Oh my god! Yo! Look at my glorious boy! That's like the dude. <laughs> Meow Scarada. Somebody at Renfair. <laughs> You're right. Oh, it's got the little floating flower thing behind it. Hell yeah, that thing's kick-ass looking. Little jester action, the magician Pokemon. This Pokemon uses the reflective fur lining its cape to camouflage the stem of its flower, creating the illusion that the flower is floating. Oh, interesting. Sneaky. Flower trick, yes. We are definitely learning that move right the hell now. Look at this attack. Look at what it does. The user throws a rigged bouquet of flowers at the target. The attack never misses and always lands a critical hit. Always. <laughs> so you found a member of the Sailor Squad, yeah, right? <laughs> Sailor Dark Side of the Moon over here. <laughs> bye bye, Seed Bomb. I'll take the Never Miss Auto Crit Attack any day <laughs> with Power Base 70. That is absurd. All right, what's your hint, child? The odd one out at one of the ice cream stands. Are these ice cream stands? Okay, that's definitely an ice cream stand. You have some ice cream. And you are a crepe place? Are those crepes? I think those are crepes. Come try a bite. Pokemon love it. Refreshing treat for sure. I guess I gotta talk to all of you. Would you like some delicious, refreshing ice cream? Fizzy Pop? Ooh, grilled rice balls. 
That's not ice cream. <laughs> sure, I'll get some grilled rice balls. Sounds tasty. One of those things is not like the other. Yeah. <laughs> Very clearly. I want to eat it, though. They I do sound tasty. Eat. Nom, 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 nom. Grilled rice balls. Please come again. Okay, that was not the thing. Greetings from Kanto. Made using the Cantonian shop owner's prize recipe, this crepe is topped with strawberries and chocolate. Hmm, interesting. Humongo power ice. What does that do? Teensy power, steel. Oh, he's like power up your uh, your attacks probably or something. No. No. Humongo power ice will increase your chances of catching. Huge ice pokemon. Okay. Bigger ones, that is. Interesting. Okay. Well, I'll get a banana crepe, I guess. Why not? I love how the Pokemon are foodies in this game. Yeah, that's true. Me too. If I was a Pokemon, I would be a foodie. 100%. Oh, I need to update my little list. You're a Pokemon. You already are a foodie. Well, yeah, but I'm not a Pokemon. <laughs> okay, so Florigato goes away. Meowscarada. Nice. I'm yelling. I want a grass cat. Weed kitty. Okay. So is the hint just crepes? Or am I, like, clearly missing something here? Do I have to order something from each of them? And I'm willing to help you here. What about teriyaki ice cream with that? Teriyaki ice cream? Who had that? That's when you checked. You got distracted by the rice balls. Am I supposed to order that one? Huh? I'll give it a shot. I'm not going to just tell you what it is even if I knew. <laughs> if I don't know, I can tell you to do whatever the fuck. Yeah, the grilled rice balls. That's what I thought. I ordered them, but they didn't, like, I thought they were going to, like, tell me something after I ordered them, so. I'm I'm guessing grilled rice balls is just the hint. I don't know. I'll find out when I get in there, I'm sure. I'll take one, one more look at them, though. Let's make sure there's, like, nothing there. Yeah, these rice balls have been grilled to perfection. The soy sauce-based marinade is very fragrant. All right, I guess that's my hint. I gotta talk to some regulars at the, the restaurant. So I guess we head on in. The famed Treasure Eatery, Badali's most famous restaurant. The Treasure Eatery is right here. We also have a secret dish for those who are currently taking on the gym test. Thanks. Can I go in here and talk to people, or is it not gonna let me? Aha, I can. Hello. Some kind of amazing gimmick. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Secret menu item. Don't know anything about that. Munch, munch, munch. Gulp. Are you a regular here? Oh, I suppose I do come here often. You must be a gym test challenger. Here's a tip for you. A nice squeeze of lemon gives any dish a refreshing kick. Thanks for the meal. You, talk to me. Damn you. There's more people to talk to, but I guess lemon is the uh, probably the answer. Look at that piggy boy. Oink, oink, oink. Okay, I can't talk to you. I don't think I've had grub as good as this. Cool, thanks. You can change your Pokemon's Terra type here. Say what? No way. One of the gym chest challengers. I hope you're able to figure out our special secret menu item. Gym test. Order the secret menu item. Rice balls that are spicy. Okay, so yeah. I'll be ordering grilled rice balls. And what serving size will you be having? What?
Um, that I didn't pick up. Whose hint was that? Fire Blast was supposed to be one of the hints. So I'm assuming large? I don't know. How do you want that cooked? Oh, Fire Blast style. I missed one of the hints. And a lemon. All right, so... I probably fucked up. Oh, I didn't find the bird that talks. Gotcha. Damn it. <laughs> so close. I forgot about the blue bird. Blue bird that talks. Yeah. I know where the bird is, though. I will go ask him. Bird boy. Tell me the size of my order. Talking bird. Why aren't you talking to me? Talk a billy, talk a billy. Isn't he just the cutest and this ain't nothing? No think, no think. Head empty. <laughs> medium, medium. Okay, thanks. Thanks, bird. What a goofball. All right, we got it now. Now I know the order. Yes, I know the thing. I can do the test. I have all the answers. Grilled rice balls. Medium. Fire blast style. With a lemon. Aha! That is correct. What happened to all the people who were eating at the restaurant? <laughs> Did they just get teleported into nowhere? They were fake. Yeah, they're fake people. They got fake customers in the restaurant. They're inflating their numbers. I want to feed them. <laughs> I see it. The tactic is here. Are you the gym leader? Mr. Waiter, the exceptional everyman himself, Gym Leader Larry, yes. Please head into the battle court. Larry, you're up! <laughs> oh, that's Larry. <laughs> oh, he oh, looks. Wow. He looks really tired of this job. He looks really Larry. <laughs> yeah. Hello. I'm Larry. I'm assigned to work as the gym leader of the Medali gym. Good job on making your way through the gym test. And, uh, well, maybe try the other dishes on the menu too sometime. Everything's pretty good here. Yeah, I tried yeah. this large. Uh, I downgraded because I was full, but I wanted to eat more. Anyway, my boss will dock my pay if I spend too much time chit chatting. Let's just get this over with. God, this dude is the most unenthusiastic gym leader they've ever made. That's brutal. <laughs> this poor guy. Thank you for doing business with us today. I, Larry, will be at your service. <laughs> you know they're loosening the door tight. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Watch this dude actually be like a badass fucking battler, though. I just ate, so let's not go too hard or anything. Comatose little koala bear. Reflect, baby. What you got, koala? Sleepy boy. Yeah, I had a feeling that was coming. All right. I really want to test this cat out now. He's got that flower trick move. Ooh, I got I got to go for it. I got to see what it does. This is going to get nasty real quick. Get him, Despacito. Slam! Come on and slam. And welcome to the jam. Flower trick. Shing! Boom! Oh my god! Ow. Yeah, just bite his ass. Stop! 
Down you go. You can't hurt me through my reflect. <laughs> Ooh, the Dun Dun Sparse is coming out, though. I'll keep my current Pokemon. What you got, Dun Dun Sparse? Look at that boy. Ooh, he's got like an extra body section now. Let's Terrastalize. Fuck it. Let's go for broke. I got that reflect up. Let's see how much damage this can really do. If only this thing could learn Swords Dance. That would be savage. Oh, you are in for a world of pain. Ooh. Oh, you're going to paralyze me? Axe. All right. You'll get one free shot on me. I got a paralyzed heal in here somewhere. I'm gonna risk it. Watch it just spam glare again. Hyper drill! Woo! Getting a little frisky there. You're going down. God, that is savage. A Star Raptor? You know what? I think I do want to send somebody else out after that. This is probably not going to work out super well. But these two could easily take that thing down. If they'll listen to me. They're not gonna. But one stone edge should take that star after out cleanly. The <laughs> move is just extra. It really is. I love it. This is still better than getting cornered by my boss. This dude is so depressing. <laughs> oh, that's right. You know, intimidate. I forgot about that. That's slightly annoying. All right. You gonna listen to me? You're pretty good. I might end up losing this. Come on, Larry, step it up a notch. That's your boss. We got hungry customers waiting. Give them something to cheer for, you hear? That Star Raptor's gonna know close combat. I just know it. It's gonna fucking annihilate me. Yay! Are you gonna? Is everyone gonna make him uh, actually show some emotion? Well, you heard the good folks. I suppose I can put on a bit more of a show. <laughs> he like tight, like adjusts his tie as he does it. <laughs> what, a, what a sad man. <laughs> I think it's time to show you that real life isn't all just being true to yourself. Ooh, it notes facade. Interesting choice. Not very effective, though. Damn it, he won't obey. He's got leftovers, though. That's handy. Ah, there goes the reflect. I'm in danger. Come on, Pupitar. Do it for me, buddy. There it is. Oh, that's right. He doesn't have the, the flying type anymore. Oh, shit. That's not as effective as I thought it was going to be. Crap. It's still pretty strong, but... Oh, wait. Did he lose his weakness to... Or invulnerability to Earthquake because he's terastalized into a normal type? I want to test this for science. Ow. Nice crit. Punk. Come on. Hit him with the earthquake. I want to kill a bird with an earthquake. earthquake. He's not doing it. 
He <laughs> just doesn't want to listen to anything I have to say. Ugh. Fine, I'll use a potion on you. God. Come on, Pupitar. Work with me here, buddy. This bird's getting annoying. I mean, I love Star Raptor. It's an awesome Pokemon, but... It's not doing any damage, and it keeps using the same move. And my stupid Pupitar won't do what I want, because I need this gym badge to get it to listen to me. Oh, dude, you can hit him with Earthquake. Legit. It doesn't do a whole lot of damage, though. It does about the same. That Intimidate kind of messed me up. At least it doesn't miss. So there's that. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'll wait back. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> we provide plenty of fan service here. Don't you worry. <laughs> Peter. Yeah, there's also the cat. Oh, he's in his thing. I can turn the cat cam back on. There you go. Have some Peter Panther action. Oh, this is bad. All right. I'm just going to let the, the Pupitar get knocked out. This, this is getting annoying. I can, but I don't want to risk one of my other Pokemon taking a free hit from the facade that it keeps spamming. Mm. So I'll just let him get knocked out. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. I love that. I cannot see chat in any capacity. So, yay. Cool. I'm in on it, too. I love how the Pupitar likes me enough to not faint when it gets low on health. It but just it wants to fuck you over. It doesn't like me enough to do what I want it to do. Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you punk. <laughs> All right, down you go, Pupitar. We'll, we'll work out our problems later, buddy. Okay, I think Despacito should be faster than this thing. We can send you in and mop this up. Oh, that's awesome. I love having all the, the, the hooked up connected screens and stuff in the house. That's always really cool. All right, you're going down, bird boy. Kabok. Squack. All right, sad boy. What are you going to do now? <laughs> Be sad. Oh, you certainly threw me for a loop. <laughs> this poor guy, dude. <laughs> He's the most depressed gym leader in the world. You're rather strong, aren't you? Enough to bring out my poker face, even. What does that mean? What does that mean? You. I don't know what that means with him. I love how he just has like square pupils. <laughs> I lost. So that means I have to give you a badge. But. Oh, his tummy is rumbling. That battle made me a bit hungry. Care to join me for a meal? I would love to. Hell yeah. Oh, there you go. Now he smiles when he eats. He's not smiling. He's just talking to say he's the Guarantee it. Not gonna lie, even the chefs cheered him on, yeah, right? <laughs> Still a better gym leader than Whitney. Whitney was pretty rough. Oh man, only up to level what 40. I was complaining about for like three hours earlier every time. Somebody mentioned rollout. Somebody mentioned rollout, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it do be like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I remember nothing but your milk. <laughs> this is for you, though hopefully a child like you has no need to put on its namesake. What's. Facade. Oh. <laughs> Oh, dear God. Yeah, it doubles if they're poisoned, burned, or paralyzed. That's why I wasn't going to hit that thing with a status effect. The dishes here, they've all got flavor. Good flavor, I mean. 
Oh, don't worry about the bill. I do earn a salary after all. I better get back to work. If you'll excuse me. Have a nice day. <laughs> I'm frightened of that man more than I've ever been frightened of anything in Pokemon ever. He's, he's certainly a unique character. <laughs> Alistar from Sword? Yeah, that was a cool gym leader. Hell yeah. Oh, Lunacy! Hola! Caught you just as you finished up in here, huh? Nice work! That puts you four badges in now, right? Man, that's awesome. I can't believe you're halfway through your gym journey already. Your efforts are bearing so much fruit so quickly. That's me. I'm Lola. I'm fruit. <laughs> Makes me just want to challenge you to a battle right here, right now. But I'm going to have to wait. Because I put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader. Dang it. When I battle you, I want to do it under the best possible conditions, which means this time I've got to ask for a rain check. Ugh, this is the worst timing ever. Sorry, Lunacy. Forgive me! <laughs> you are not forgiven. <laughs> I think probably one of my uh, favorite gym leaders was the, uh, the, the dark type gym leader from Sun and Moon. The, like, cop dude who ran the um, Team Skull Island. Because I totally did not expect him to, like, be the, the kahuna of the island and, like, be, like, the dude that I had to fight. It, like, came out of nowhere. I was like, wait, this dude's the leader? No way. And, uh, just the way his whole demeanor changed as soon as the fight began. All right. Four gym battles down and my pupitar still <laughs> is too high of a level to listen to me. Why? Why is it like this? <laughs> uh, Alright, I need to find another gym to go beat. <laughs> A fire cloister! Nice, dude! Yeah, time to hit the next gym badge. I'm gonna have to just do, like, six of them. I need to get, like, six gym badges tonight. <laughs> Just so I can... Man, like, in the olden days, it used to go up more than just five, two at a time. Isn't that kind of weird? Because it used to be, like, you'd go, like, it would skip a couple, and then it would go, like, jump all up to, like, 35, and then, like, all the way up to 50, and then all the way up to, like, 80, and then, like, any Pokemon after that would listen to you. And this one, it's really creeping along at a slow pace. Like, you almost have to do the gym battles first, just so you don't overlevel. All right, what do we got here? What's the next gym that I can go and fight? Um, got an electric gym. I have a ima I imagine Canis wants to watch me fight the electric gym. <laughs> I believe Canis had some difficulties with that one. So sure, why the hell not? Let's go do the electric gym. You ready, boys? <laughs> yeah, just get all eight problems solved. Yeah, that's what I'm almost going to have to do. Yeah. <laughs> electric gym. Oh, really? So you had troubles with them too, huh? Interesting. Oh, I have defeated zero trainers out there. Maybe I should go uh, distract myself a bit with some trainer battles out in this region. Get a little practice in before I settle in for the main event. Oh, no. And the Sneasel's level 41, too. Yikes. This is a problem. All right, let's go fight six trainers out here, and then we'll go take on the electric gym. And then maybe, finally, I'll be able to have my Pokemon respect me. <laughs> I don't want to do my job. No. Then don't. <laughs> Christian, the office worker. What is with all the, the like, office worker dudes in this region just 
hating their jobs. This is <laughs> this is pretty absurd. Light screen. Maybe. Fairy lock. Oh, is that an arena trap? Oh no, I've been arena trapped. That's a problem. All right. Now oh, and it's a fairy type too. Crap. Oh, I don't like this. I can't switch. And its attacks are super effective. Great. Well, luckily it's a low level. It's still going to take me a while to beat it up. Ooh, was that a crit? Yeah, lucky. Nice. Clutch. All right, now the taunt's going to wear off. Yep. Go in for another one. <laughs> who teaches the psychic Pokemon ghost moves? Uh, people who like to cover their weaknesses. Oh, you got a Dragapult. Legit. Dragapult kicks ass. Get that clef key out of here. You meanie head. Are you like eight, sir? <laughs> <laughs> What a strange person. All right, let's go hunt down some more trainers. Super potions. I'm hoping that they do the thing where like, as long as you're like really close to the level that they're supposed to listen to you, they're more likely to listen to you and not just one level over and you're screwed. That would not be fun, but we'll have to find out. Yep, let's get a little health back to my, uh, my little gremlin here. You know what? I want to become real strong, just like Missy Nimona is. I know that person. Lena the student. Who means business. He's got a bear. That is most certainly a bear. Reflect. My attack fell. Well, I don't much care for that. But you are also made of ice and very meltable. <laughs> All of your Pokemon were a level over the max. Ouch. That is, uh, that is not a good position to be in, sir. That's why I'm, like, panicking and trying to get through these gyms as fast as I can. <laughs> Which is gonna be a problem, because I know I'm gonna have to fight, like, a Titan Pokemon at some point here. This is going to be a, a very, very tight run. All right, there's two trainers down. Four more to go in this region. And then we go and defeat the gym. I don't really ha Oh, wait. The one Pokemon that I do have that would wreck the electric gym would be Pupitar, but... Of course... He won't listen to me. I guess grass is decently good. Because grass, I think, resists electricity, anyway, at least. So, if I can set up my cat with the hone claws, get that stage of uh, attack up, and get them auto crits, he should be pretty good swiping through that. It's just not good. What's not good? Your your battling skills? 
I can't control my power. Ooh, show me. I'm so tempted. I didn't say I can't control my power. I said I can't control my pupitar. That's a very different animal. <laughs> that is just an Amomomola. What do you even do besides heal yourself and get hit? Oh, you know Aqua Jet. I'm not really terribly worried about that, but I'll set up a Reflect anyways. Why not? I can do this all day. There you go. Heal yourself. And it's cat time. <laughs> yeah, nice. What you got, Amola Momola? Aloma Lola Mola Mola Mola. Yeah, you, you can keep hitting me with that. It only does one damage. I really don't care. There we go. Let's get that stage of attack up. And annihilate. Ooh, was that a crit? That was a crit. That did three damage. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Too funny. Thanks for helping me tamp down my power like that. It can be pretty overwhelming. Oh, okay. Look out, guys. <laughs> Is that a Magnemite? That's just a that whole-ass Magnemite. Nice. Psychic terrain. Useless for me. Arm. Where's the rest of the people that want to fight me? I need more victims. I mean volunteers. <laughs> Turtles. Doodle, doodle, doodle. Boing. Ay, 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 ay. Get that derpy duck. It hurts. It's too derpy. I can't handle it. I can't handle the derp. Ooh, a TM. I like those. Light screen! Already got it. Thanks, though. Where are the rest of these people hiding at? They all down here on the beach or something? There's one. Is that a wiggle? I want to be like the wind and travel across the whole wide world. Then, uh, you do that. Jonathan. <laughs> Wait a second. No, it is not spelled right. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that is just a deer. Oh, dear. Curb stomp your confidence. Yes. Yes, that. I'm pretty sure that's what they meant, because that's what I did. <laughs> All right, Inferno. You know what to do. I expect no mercy. Ow. Good thing I got that reflect up. That would have been embarrassing. Nice. Clean. A Stantler. 
Uh, nah, I'll keep my current Pokemon out. I'm pretty sure I can handle a Stantler. This person likes deer. Roasty Toasty. Good doggo. All right, two more trainers to go, and I can collect my reward and go take on the gym. Maybe do a little grinding, but I'm kind of getting worried that I'm over grinding now. You think? Yeah. I need to save some wiggle room <laughs> so I can do some other stuff. Sandy guests! Aw, oh, look at that little child soul stealing Pokemon. It's adorable. What are you? You are just a weird looking duck. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Oh, cool, a water stone. Well, those are nice. Dude, a Gyarados! Say what? Fuck yeah, dude, there's a fucking Gyarados over there. I want to be number one. Do you? Let's see what you got, kid. My favorite sandcastle, yes. I I am in agreement. Just don't touch his shovel. Ooh, we got the low kicks out here. We got the little bug boy. I know you only do physical attacks. So, reflect is all I need for your ass. Ooh, coming at me with the U-turn. Who else you got? You got two Pokemon, kid? Got a bird. Also a physical attacker. But we're good there. Um, yeah, let's send out the little Ponyard boy. Why not? I missed the sound effect that, uh... Um... Star you and Starmie used to make in the in the old anime. Are you just going to be pulling U-turn shenanigans this whole time? That's what it looks like. Hiya! Yep, that's just all you're going to do. <laughs> yes! It was so random. Shink. Tink. Your attacks are weak. They do nothing. Go, little barnyard. Destroy. Cleave them in twain. Good boy. Nah, I'm good. Sandwich time? Mm -hmm. Sandwich time! But they need to mimic a fraction of our power. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Ponyard just looks like a bloodthirsty little Pokemon. <laughs> He's just so excited. Nah. <laughs> I freaking love him. I guess maybe we could share being number one. Nope, sorry, kid. I don't share. You're out of luck. Beached. They are Magikarps. I would like to stress. <laughs> I think that might go without saying. Technically not the brightest animal. They're just out there uh, practicing their jumping skills so they can get drafted into Magikarp Jump. That, that's what they're doing. Most certainly. The nice little flock of hopips. Sure be a shame if a Houndoob came in here and lit them all on fire.
<laughs> Being a Pokemon trainer sure is hard. Tough work, guys. <laughs> Good job, everybody. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Give me my prize. I beat all six of your trainers. Nope, I only beat five. I missed one. Son of a bitch. Who'd I miss? Where are you? I don't see them anywhere. Are they like probably on the other side of the Pokemon Center? Would be my guess. Oh, dude, a whole herd of Tauros. Kick ass. I really like the, the black Tauros. Oh, you. You're the person that I missed. Have you been to the Great Crater of Paldea? Uh, nope. It is strictly forbidden for anyone to go there. I don't know why you would assume anyone would be able to go there. <laughs> kind of illegal, my dude. Keep my eyes peeled for a Tauros with red streaks in his hair. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, that's a good point. I, I don't want to do that to you. That would be a uh, cruel and unusual punishment uh, morale. <laughs> oh, it's a fighting fire Tauros. Yo, that's cool. You could get a fire cow. Do you want a fire cow, Lulo? No. Yeah. <laughs> All right, six trainers down now, most certainly. Oh, Magberry. Wait, there's deer. Oops, I accidentally ran into him. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well, I'll just light it on fire. Barbecue. Mmm, venison. I know, they're so tiny. So tiny. <laughs> little deer had like the little nervous sweat drops coming out of its head as the Hound Doom turned around like, oh shit. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Outstanding. Okay. Are you going to give me anything that's even worth it? Probably not. All right. What's my prize? Stomping Tantrum. That's sometimes an interesting move. No Tyranitar can learn it, but that only work if he had like Sucker Punch and like failed and then swapped to that. Which isn't the best tactic to use with him. Allie, what's up? Cruel punishment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're here to dish them out. Nice. <laughs> How's your night going, Allie? Good to see you. About to go see if I can get my butt kicked at another gym. Although, uh, so far, my, my track record's pretty darn good. But we shall see if we can change that. Oh, speaking of which. Ah, nah, they'll only listen to me up to level 40. I don't want to push it too much. I could get in trouble if I go a little too hard with that. All right, here's the gym. What do we got for a challenge here? What's our little mini game we got to do? We had to go track down some flowers. We had to roll a giant olive. We had to solve a puzzle at a restaurant. And we had to go bring some dude his wallet. I saw you going into the gym and came running. Listen, I'm really sorry I couldn't battle you last time we ran into each other. Wait, don't get me wrong. I didn't chase you down just to battle you. Then again, I guess I wouldn't mind a battle or anything if you wanted to. What do you say? Sure, why not? Have at it, boss. Yes, battle time! 
Wait, hold on. I want to be sure to pick the right Pokemon for where you're at in your journey. Sorry, give me a sec to fine-tune my team, and then we can battle. Bring it. What you got? You're going to be using the exact same team you've been using the whole time? Uh, I'm, I'm winning, yeah. Winning pretty good, actually. But we'll see if we can change that. <laughs> so far, I've only wiped once, whereas the uh, the squirrel, I think, is up to six. <laughs> where where did she go? She said she wanted to fight me. Then she ran out of the door. And now I have no idea where she went. All right, I guess we'll just ride around town on my dragon until I can find it. Ooh, wise glasses. Slightly boost the power of their special moves. Oh, speaking of which, I should also change the order of my Pokemon. Get my Waller out first. Oh, that's the arena. Nice, that's a kick-ass arena, dude. All lifted up over the water and everything. Hell yeah. And she's not in here, is she? Nope. I did not hear where she went at all. Okay. Well, I guess I'm just going to go do the gym then. I thought she wanted to fight. Well, you snooze, you lose. Let's hope I don't lose it all. Nah, I'll be good. I had my one wipe. That's all right, though. That was early on. Let me register as you a challenger. Yes, thank you. All right, what's the challenge? Now, in order to face gym leader Iono, you first need to pass the gym test. Yes, I know. Here at the Lavincia gym, that means staring in one of Lono's streams? Starring. Oh, starring. Two R's is starring. I, I misread that. I think it should be backwards, but whatever. <laughs> Lono's a streamer. Oh, no. Is this a making fun of streamers bit that Pokemon's doing? Am I about to be called out here? Well, now I know who this is. How do you do a gym that sounds extremely painful? It would be. I mean, especially if you're focusing on the equipment. Or, or are we talking about the membership? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Want you to dazzle our audience with your skills and rack up those subscriptions. Oh, great. Just head outside and you'll soon find out what you need to do. Now get out there and have fun. Oh, goody. Does so anyone have any Prime subscriptions since we're over here talking about it? Yeah, right? The answer is very carefully. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Iono Zone. Oh, great. Boop -a -doop -a -doop. Oh. What the? <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Your eyeballs are mine! Caught in my electroweb! Who's what's it? Iono, I'm the gym leader here! Hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour! Do you know any language completely or just. I have no idea. You are an internet, aren't you? Oh, snap! Look at you! Already a master of Lono e Iono ease! Not your first rodeo, then, eh? I guess not. And uh, I hope this doesn't come as too much of a surprise. But you're being broadcast live to the world right now. Smile. Anywho, Challenger, thanks for coming out to the Lavincia Gym to see me. I'm super happy you're here, but I'm also kind of a bit of a celebrity. You know, I'm all kinds of busy. <laughs> I can't collab with you unless I know you can bring in those sweet, sweet viewer numbers. I hate this person immediately. <laughs> I mean, I gotta make sure you can bring some real passion to my stream. <laughs> and so, if you want to battle me, you're gonna have to help me make this live stream a viral hit first, got it? Sure, buddy. Ugh, I want those Magnemites. Yeah, the, the, the cool colored Magnemites is awesome. <laughs> I can tell you just can't wait to get started. Well, well, well then, allow me to explain the plan. Come on out, Mr. Walksabout. Mr. Walks about? That's that's my school principal. Oh, Lunacy. What a coincidence meeting you here. Say what? You guys know each other or something? Does she have shark teeth? This here dude's had a real aura about him when he was walking down the street, so I snatched him up for my dealio here. Oh, you don't even... 
You don't even know who he is. <laughs> yup. You are, um, too kind. <laughs> well, anywho, Lunacy, since you're today's challenger, I'm gonna have you play hide and seek with Mr. Walks about here. Look for the good gentleman using the street surveillance cameras. Find him three times, and you can consider this gym test passed. We need a better name for this challenge, though. I'll call it Where in Lavincia is Mr. Walks About? Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? You think that title's safe? There's nothing iffy about it or anything, right? Eh, whatevs. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to go. Get ready to hide, Mr. Walks About. This gym leader has to be all like, yeah, right? Let's battle on live stream. Baseball keyboard. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. I feel that I owe the Pokemon League for many a past favor, so I'm more than happy to help. Do bear with me as I try my best to, uh, my allocated role. Yeah, he looks like he's super good at hide-and-seek. I like her character design. Uh, the talking I could do a little less with. Ha ha ha! Ready he be! the stream? <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> Savage. Mr. Fox about is hiding somewhere in this video feed. Friendo. <laughs> says friendo. Nice. Open those eyes wide like a magnemite and get to searching. Can magnemites even close their eyes? Is that a thing that they're capable of doing? I mean, he's literally right there. That's but he, not. But he's behind the thing. <laughs> That's that is not hiding. <laughs> I didn't think he was hiding. I said he's behind a third. <laughs> oh dear, it seems you've found me. Oh my me. god. Oh my god. I, you're fucking... <laughs> Our challenger has found Mr. Walksabout. Whoosh, wowza, you did it. You're one cool kid. Well then, before we move on to the next round, let's make things a little more interesting. You get to have a battle with one of my fans. Get out of here, you silly Pokemaniac. What? Uh, all right. The Iono Hype Squad is here. Long live the Iono Zone. <laughs> For the Queen. <laughs> Alright, Marty, you need to dial it back about like five notches. <laughs> he does have a pants cat. Pants cat. It's glorious. Ding! He's a charge in his laser. Ladies, okay. yum, 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 yum. Absolutely. All right, Luxio. Who do I want to beat you up with? So many choices. Uh, you know what? Let's just go for the dog. Why not? I love that freaking noise that Luxio makes. It's such a good Pokemon cry. Thundershock! Nasty plot. Why are you using a special attack move? You're a physical attacker, Luxio. Should really uh, be doing something a little different there. Oh well, you're about to be barbecue. Sorry, kitty. You get to go to the burn ward. <laughs> Well, that was easy. That was probably a little bit of overkill. <laughs> Win or lose, I own a hype squad forever. What a true fan. You'd be sitting out in the open. Oh dear, you found me. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> just... It's like a child hiding behind a fence post. <laughs> and you win. Well done, challenger friendo. I swear, if you say the word beans, you will be the perfect amalgamation of all the streamer tropes. <laughs> Time for a change of scenery. <laughs> oh, you know, she also needs to say, let's go. She hasn't said that yet. She needs to loudly ex exclaim, let's go. There we go. Here we go. That's close. That's almost there. The next stage for my totally rad test. Everybody loves it. It's the Pokemon Center. What? Mr. Walksabout is once again hiding in the feed somewheres. Panic! Ah, find him and quick! He's he's right there. He's he's just standing in the Pokemon. 
This is the easiest game of Where's Waldo I've ever played. Oh, dear, I thought I had blended into my surroundings quite well. Yes, you look so much like Nurse Joy. It's a striking resemblance, really. <laughs> I miss Zarbon. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> hey Vegeta <laughs> right but I'm just playing where's Waldo yes I knew you were something special let's spice things up again before moving on to ye oldie next round that's right it's another Pokemon battle get out here oh joy this I was watching I can't lose oh god Performance anxiety! That is a Tynamo. That is a very tiny, useless fish. Oh, but you have two Pokemon. Alright. Light screen it is. Shing! What you got, fish boy? Ow! Rude. How dare you hit me with that move? You know what? I'm going to taunt you and sucker punch him in the face. <laughs> I just love how Dark-type Pokemon's moves just sound brutal. <laughs> Ooh, a crit. Not bad. Getting that special attack up. And now you're going to get decked. Wham! <laughs> Next. Who else we got on the chopping block here? A Flaffy! Bleep, bleep, don't fuck with the sheep. The Grim Reaper. Quick, someone help Jeffy hide. <laughs> Can we gorilla glue this gym leader's mouth shut asking for a friend? Well, you know, after I'm done beating them, we might be able to arrange that. <laughs> I'll support the glue cost. <laughs> My Pokemon will hold him down. <laughs> Ooh, that's some nicely roasted cheap right there. Rawr. <laughs> Why does Houndoom's roar almost kind of sound like the T Rex roar from Jurassic Park? <laughs> Anyone else notice that? <laughs> you know what I haven't lost to you in? My devotion to Miss Iono. Oh. <laughs> and you win. Well done, Challenger Friendo. And there's no stopping you. Master of Seeking and Master of Battle, and you're the real deal. Alrighty then. Time for a change of scenery. Can we fight yet? The last stage will be this place right here, the battle court, where battles are raging. Can you find where Mr. Walks about among these randos? Let's find out. Ready, go! He's on a boat. I'm on a boat. Everybody look at me. My, my. Admirably done. I hope you will find your treasure in your independent study with just as much ease. I thought I was just going to say, oh dear, again. He's beneath the Peter. Yeah, that's true. Sorry, my my the Peter cam was covering him up. <laughs> we have a bug type Pokemon. We can just string shot her mouth shut. <laughs> you know, that's a good point. We could <laughs> throw her at Officer Jenny. Woo! My subscriber numbers are on the rise like a super fast Electros crawling out of the ocean. Woo I mean, congratulations on passing my gym test. Ha! Diggity dang! What a good time, huh? No, I hated it. You had people on the edge of their seats worldwide. I bet I could have some super rad streams by collabing with you. Uh, I'm kind of busy. I don't know if I if I have time for that. <laughs> so, hey, when you're ready, just hit up my lobby staff. Look at y'all set up with a collab. Lickety split. I'll be ready to go. Winevs. Oh, I can't wait to beat this person so I can never do that voice again. <laughs> My soul, it hurts. <laughs> Just do a, um, 
bad dub version where you, you know, abridge the text. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Translate it for the rest of I the I mean, day. it's already an abridged version of itself. Ugh. <laughs> Gym leader was the cause of many lost brain cells. Yeah, yeah, I can feel them leaking out of my ears as we speak. <laughs> Give her to the mom. I don't know, we could dangle them from the string, you know, from the rope and then uh, just uh, have the houndoom barbecue them for a while. The pain never goes away if you get burned by a houndoom. Sounds like a fitting punishment. <laughs> All right, let's finish this up. And then I'll probably wrap up stream for tonight after this gym battle. Y'all ready for this? All righty, here we go. I see Aono gave your performance a thumbs up. Amazing job. Well done on clearing the gym test. You've now earned the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to challenge? Yes. The supercharged streamer? Yeah, I think I can handle that. No comment. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I feel like handing her over to her fans might be too cruel of a punishment, considering how obsessed they were. <laughs> Beer the belly toad. Is it just an electric type? What's it do? Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Ooh, the music's kind of cool, though. Your eyeballs are mine. I do like that. Caught in my electroweb. Who's a what's it? I don't know. Hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour. It's time for the Iono Zone, everybody. Yay. It's a rather fitting punish. It uses all of its girth. It's a true menace, huh? All right. Is it a physical attacker or a special attacker? Flying high like a watchrel. It's lunacy. Flying high like a what? What did you call me? <laughs> How you feeling about this battle? Like I can't lose. We got a lively one here. You'd make a gnarly influencer. Alrighty then, who's ready to see me kick some butt? Looks like you're all getting hyped. A Pidgey bread with a Zapdos. Oh, a little electric bird. Cool. All right, let's get this show on the road. I agree. The outfit is pretty cool, though. Not gonna lie. Oh, that's a Watchroll. <laughs> ah, that thing. Give me a battle that'll electrify my viewers, pals. You got it. So you got four Pokemans, huh? Okay. Light screen it is. Bruce Willis walking away from the explosion. Yeah, I feel like it kind of would be. Um, Let's get the... You know what? Yeah, let's just get the dog out here. Wait. I'm going to set up a reflect, too, just in case. And we're going to nasty pot flamethrower all over this business. Think. Okay. We're good to go. Easy peasy. Burn it all with fire. Purge. Heresy detected. <laughs> <laughs> you got one shot, bird. Make it count. Oh, you barely do any damage. I'm just gonna rack up some nasty plots here. Should we just go for broke, get the max nasty plot combo going here? 
long as I don't get paralyzed. Nah, I think two's good. Barbecue time. Time to sweep. Belly bolt. Nope. Now, is this thing a water type? It looks like a water type. Ah, eh, we're gonna find out. <laughs> Electromorphosis. Good job, Belly Bolt. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Freaking Hound Doom. Ooh, Night Slash. Yes, that is much better than Bite. I will take that. Because that's power 70 with a high crit chance. The flinching is nice. But that crit's a little better, I think. <laughs> Looks like the punching bag that kicked Bo's ass. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Aluxio. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep the Hound Doom out here. <laughs> he's doing pretty good so far. I think he's got this one in the bag. Oh no, you lowered my physical attack. I'm so scared. Burn. <laughs> Delete. 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 <laughs> oh no, my light screen wore off. Ooh, a Miss Magius. Oh, you're going to turn into an electric type. Oh, no, this isn't good, loyal fans. I need to hear you cheering. Give me all you got. I'm going to turn my ghost into an electric ghost. Why don't you just have a Rotom? So Snarl's not going to work on you because you're just going to turn into an electric type. So barbecue it is. Two rest alive. I don't even have to use my crystallization in this fight. <laughs> oh, you poor ghost. You better hope you knock my Houndoom out. You got one shot. Nope, never mind. You didn't even get that. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Clean sweep. <laughs> Whew. That was rough. <laughs> you didn't even get any of my Pokemon under 50% health. <laughs> You're as flashy and bright as a 10 million volt Thunderbolt, friendo. Thanks, I think. What a WW Jeff Hardy, it's right. <laughs> Delete! <laughs> Challenger came out victorious. Well done. Whoa, you're both so strong. Thanks. I hate to say it, but I lost. Thanks for cheering me on anyhow, my loyal fans. Well then, what does our challenger get for beating me? The lean, mean, streaming queen. I'll tell you, you win a gym badge. Wow, I would have never guessed. Screen cap this quick. This will be the shot you'll want to save in your brain spaces forever. That was a sentence that was just said out loud. <laughs> she says, friendo, one more time, I'm going to scream. <laughs> See, it's I like it when people say friendo sometimes, but the way she does it just bothers me. <laughs> Buy the Bizies. Five gym badges, Pokey Pals of up to level 45 will be easier to catch and they'll listen to you. Finally, my pupitar will listen to my commands. I can finally use my pupitar. It's been so long. I spent all night just trying to get that. <laughs> Ooh, Volt Switch. Ooh, that's dirty. Do I have a Pokemon that can learn that? I'm gonna blow up the Pokemon Tower. <laughs> yeah, right. Ah. <sighs> Any of you found our electrifying battle to be shocking, go smash that subscribe button. Your eyeballs are mine. That is my favorite thing that you say. 
<laughs> Give me your eyes. <laughs> That's one of the things I, I like try to keep in my head to shout. <laughs> to be crazy enough to be left alone. Right. That does like it sounds like something that I would say. <laughs> I guess I fit into some kind of streaming trope. You and some of your friends you grew up with are part of why I'm trained like this. Yeah. Another gym leader defeated. Well done. Rika informing that there was an unusual trainer worth keeping an eye on. It seems she meant you, I guessed as much. I had the pleasure of observing your last match. I was impressed by the fantastic skill you showed. You managed to keep your momentum and achieve champion rank. I'll be very interested in inviting you to the Pokemon League. Oh, there's Nimona. You're a little late. I already beat the gym. I saw you battling the gym leader. You just keep getting better. How good to see you again, champion Nimona. It's certainly been a while. Oh, wait. The Primera. Uh, why do you call her that? Wait, did I forget to give you the full explanation? Everyone calls Miss Gita Lee Primera because she's just that. She's the real number one, so you're the real champion. So you're the one that's actually after the Elite Four. Gotcha. That's why you look so cool. Yes, I've made quite a lot of progress. I can finally get my pupitar to listen to my commands. <laughs> yeah. I do indeed hold that claim alongside my role as chairwoman of the Pokemon League, that is... I thought you were too busy to spend time with your checking in on gyms. I'm not here to inspect the gym. I've come to scout some rather promising young talent. Whoa, I look away for a second and you're famous. But hey, I found him first. He's mine. Hey, don't fight over me. <laughs> you can't go stealing him from me. Whoa. Oddly possessive. I suppose I'll have to get in line. No, no, don't worry. There's no line. <laughs> okay, I gotta go fight you. Fine, I'll, I'll fight you before I end stream today. <laughs> Do what Magi does. Stubborn that shit. Yeah, right? I, I've had to a little bit. Sounds fun, right? Sure, why not? Let's do it. I'm excited to see you two face off. Me too. Let's be on our way then. Ooh, I get an interesting TM from this fight. Should have just bit your pupitar's ear. <laughs> he doesn't have ears. <laughs> He's a cocoon. <laughs> it normally works with animals. I don't know if it works with giant rock mountain dinosaurs. <laughs> but you know what? We'll give it a shot. When he grows ears, I'll bite him. <laughs> After he's done gestating in his pupa state. <laughs> Remember how it all works, right? Once you get badges from all the gyms, you get to throw down against the strongest trainers around. Yep, Pokemon League, yada yada. Cool, awesome. Are you in the crater? I hope you're in the crater. If you can face the challenge of the final examiner and win, you'll become a champion. Just imagine that moment would feel. Yes, okay. I, I know how the Pokemon League works. Thank you for explaining that to me. Can we fight now? Sure, heal me up. I didn't need it, but I appreciate it. Then <laughs> bite it, shell. <laughs> Put it in the box while you farm for coins. <laughs> oh, you have to get a lot of coins to teach it anything. Gotcha. Alrighty. It's battle time. Show me your moves. What do you got, champion? Or kind of champion? Class champion? Ooh, you got a whole ass lichen rock now. Cool. Isn't that fancy? All right, you are definitely a physical attacker, so reflex going up first. Ooh, he's fast! Light screen. Ha <laughs> ha. Not gonna work. Alrighty. Now for a little switch in action here. Get this Despacito out. Bite the shell like it's a meatball. <laughs> nice. It's a big meatball. Yeah, go ahead. Keep hitting me with the Accel Rock. I'm gonna do some Hone Claws here while you do that. 
Yep, keep keep at it. You're doing a great job. Truly outstanding work. Yep, give me more. <laughs> Like a rock's like, this is trouble. Could you tell me to do like a slightly more useful attack? It destroyed. Bye bye time. Now you get to go in the forever box. This is gonna hurt a lot. <laughs> Blam! Ooh, 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 ooh. Love to see it. <laughs> yeah, that did have some zing to it. You're gonna be feeling a lot more of that. <laughs> yeah, I was super lucky. Not like it's a guaranteed 100% critical hit every single time I use that move or anything. <laughs> ooh, a Gooby. Yeah, I think I can take a Gumi. Not particularly worried. Bye. <laughs> Next. What else you got in there? Oh, a Palmo. Get good. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> That's what they need to do. Sayonara. Funk. Oh, poor little guy. He's so cute. He was just doing his best. God, this grass cat is just a monster. <laughs> to learn beat up. Who wants to learn beat up? Oh, you? No. Hmm... Greater the number of attacks. All party Pokemon to attack the target. The more party Pokemon. Mm. I guess that technically would be about, about as strong as Thief. But you're just going to learn a different move later. You, the only one I want you to know is Knock Off. So I don't really care about that. Oh no, my Reflect wore off. Uh, you know, you might. Bulbasaur is a poison type. So technically there would be some toxins in the air. You might die also. Oh, here comes the duck. Yep, you're back straight into a corner. Here comes the duck. But can whoa, what is going on here with that tail thing? What is this? Yo, look at this fabulous boy. I love him. Dogs are supposed to dazzle and stuff with the tail because this one's actually working. Yeah, he's working it, all right. <laughs> Memory of Yamcha. Gay. <laughs> yeah. The best kind. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Look at that fabulous duck. I love him. He's so cool. <laughs> and now he's dead. <laughs> Bye. Oh. Aww. Sorry, buddy. You put on a good show, though. No. Ducks are evil. <laughs> that might be the one duck that gets a pass. Sir Fetched also. God hates ducks. <laughs> okay, Krillin. <laughs> if you roll Spurgatito's face leap, it's a blunt. <laughs> nice. Perfect. You're right. It is getting kind of late. For me. <laughs> yeah. For, for, for the beings that are streamers, I guess. An amazing display of talent. Even against one as skilled as champion Nimona. That was a splendid match. I enjoyed watching it very much. Now even Lipramira thinks you're one to watch. You've got so much potential. The way you're going, I better watch my back. You know, since the first time we met, I've been weirdly sure of one thing. You're going to become a champion, no doubt about it. 
The rest of these gyms, you could take them, 100%, no problem. I'm a little worried about the fighting gym, I'm not gonna lie. I agree, in fact, you should take this. Consider it an investment in your future. Terra Blast. If the user has Terrastalize, it unleashes energy of the Terra type. Move inflicts damage using the attack or special attack stat, whichever one is higher for the user. That's kind of cool. I can see that being kind of useful. One day, you and me are going to have the greatest battle of all. I know it. I'm going to go train up even more than I already have been. You do that. Good luck. You're going to need it. <laughs> Perhaps she hopes you truly might rival her. No, I think she... There's, it's no mere hope. She seems to have complete faith that you will catch up to her. At any rate, allow me to return you to the gym where I found you. Thanks. I appreciate it. I, I've abducted you here. Go back where you were. I think if you smoked a Badu, it would just die. <laughs> I need to leave whatever's happening in your chat right now. I don't know if that would be a the best option. <laughs> There's not a whole lot to it. <laughs> Poor little guy. Is that a TM? Yes, it is. Struggle bug! All aboard the struggle bug! Alright. Now I'm gonna go hit up this uh, pokey center and then uh, maybe find somebody to raid. Chawamp! See if anybody's on. <laughs> Wanted to get high off of Badoo. <laughs> Gotta smoke that Badoo, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see here. Is there anybody on? Nope. Nobody that I know. Darn. Alrighty. Well, then I guess we'll just call it here for tonight. I did stay on a little later than normal. Everyone's probably already gotten off. <laughs> They're usually not on past too much later after nine. Yeah, raid these nuts. <laughs> Got him. Nice. Well, I'll give you a good send off, though. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, hope you're having fun. Hope you're all following the tournament. Uh, make sure to get into the Discord so you can track the leaderboard because not everybody who's in the competition is a streamer. And um, as soon as I get the info from the Ricky and the Pinata, I'll get up some times for when they're streaming uh, the tournament. So that way you can make sure to catch all of the action and not miss a thing. And then afterwards, when we're done, we're going to have a big battle and uh, everyone gets to participate, so. And we're gonna live stream the whole thing. Oh, I, I imagine there is a streamer named Deez Nuts. That doesn't surprise me one bit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll uh, catch you all next time. I'll probably be on Tuesday, maybe sooner. We'll see. But um, I'm gonna go do a little exploring and grinding and then uh, Try not to get too far in the game, but I might go fight some of the, the Titan Pokemon or something and get my traversal options up. But anyways, you all have yourselves a wonderful night, and I will see you next time. Bye for now. Give me your eyeball.